When a person has a fever, experiences headaches, body pains, nausea, and vomiting, it's possible they have dengue. But it's also possible that they have the flu or even coronavirus. So how are you supposed to know which is which? Here's a guide on the differences between dengue and other viral infections. Dengue mainly comes from infected mosquitoes. Symptoms include fever, headaches with eye pain, nausea, vomiting, rashes. It usually takes three to 10 days for symptoms to appear after one gets bitten by an infected mosquito. Someone with severe dengue shows the following warning signs. Abdominal pain and tenderness, frequent vomiting, mucosal bleeding or vomiting blood, restlessness. COVID-19, or the coronavirus, is caused by the virus SARS-CoV-2 and mainly transmitted from person to person. Someone with COVID-19 may show these symptoms. Fever, cough, fatigue, diarrhea, sore throat, headaches, runny nose, nausea, vomiting, shortness of breath. These symptoms often start mild and develop gradually, taking two to 14 days for symptoms to show. It is also possible to be asymptomatic, which means you don't show symptoms but are still carrying the virus and could infect others. Then there's the Zika virus, another disease that comes from mosquito bites. Someone with this disease may exhibit the following symptoms, rash, fever, joint pain, headache, muscle pain, conjunctivitis, red eyes. It usually takes two to 12 days for symptoms to show. The flu, on the other hand, is an infectious disease caused by the influenza virus, usually transmitted by respiratory droplets. Its symptoms include cough, fatigue, sore throat, runny or stuffy nose, headaches and body aches. A person with the flu may also have a fever, but not everyone with the flu will have this. It usually takes one to four days for symptoms to begin after exposure. Bronchitis is another common respiratory infection that affects the main airways of a person's lungs and can also be transmitted from person to person via respiratory droplets. Bronchitis symptoms include low fever, wheezing, sore throat, persistent coughing, blocked nose and sinuses, headaches and body aches. It may show between four to six days after infection. Getting the right diagnosis will determine the best treatment for you. If you're experiencing any of these, call your doctor to undergo the right diagnostic test. Being proactive about your health, especially when you're experiencing symptoms, can make a big difference towards recovery. Stay informed and don't be afraid to seek professional medical help to avoid a misdiagnosis and possibly the wrong treatment.